Welcome to Health Bulletin. Did you know that a common ingredient in your favorite snacks could make skin transparent? Sounds like sci-fi, right? Well, researchers from Stanford University have discovered that tartrazine, a yellow-orange dye found in foods like Doritos, can do just that. But how does it work? And could this change the way we study human tissues? Stick around, because by the end of this video, you'll know why this research could revolutionize medical science. In a recent study published in Science Journal on 6th September, Stanford scientists discovered that when tartrazine, a yellow-orange dye found in snacks, is applied to mice, it temporarily turns their skin and tissues transparent. This discovery opens up new, non-invasive ways to study internal organs and tissues without surgery. The dye absorbs blue and ultraviolet light, letting it pass through the skin, making underlying structures visible. So why do we need this kind of innovation? Imagine being able to see and study organs in real time without any surgical procedure. This could significantly reduce the need for invasive procedures in medical research, especially for monitoring diseases or understanding organ functions in their natural state. The researchers tested tartrazine on mouse skulls and abdomens, and within minutes, the skin became transparent. Once the dye was washed off, the transparency faded and it was safely excreted through the animal's urine. Now, before you start imagining this working on humans, there's a catch. Our skin is about 10 times thicker than a mouse's, so we're not there just yet. However, this breakthrough is a huge step forward in making medical research less invasive. What makes this even more exciting is how safe and cheap tartrazine is. It's already FDA approved for use in food, meaning the dye is biocompatible with living organisms. Researchers believe this could be a stepping stone for more advanced transparent skinned studies in animals and one day humans. But for now, this technique is only in its early stages. It's clear that more research is needed before we start seeing real world applications, especially for human medical use. However, this discovery could pave the way for breakthroughs in everything from neuroscience to cancer research. If you found this as mind-blowing as I did, be sure to give this video a thumbs up and share it with your friends. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button to stay in the loop on the latest in health and science. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.